Amanda. I'm the occupational therapist and certified with the Diva Therapist here at Cornerstone. Today we're going to talk about shoulder dysfunction after breast cancer treatment. So why do you have shoulder pain? Why do you have limited motion? Mostly it's you've had trauma, so whether it's a mastectomy or a lumpectomy to the front part of your chest. And most of the time you want to protect it and you're not moving as much, so you're kind of in this kind of position. Um, so then you can't really raise your arm up. Not only does this hurt, the back of your muscles here hurt, down into here in the trunk. Um, you also could have reduced scar mobility, so your scar doesn't move well, or you have what's called axillary cording, which is just a little tight band here that prevents your motion. So what we do here in the clinic, or some little things you can do at home, is some like stretching. Correct your posture, so if you notice you're like this, you want to wind those shoulders back, sit up nice and tall, maybe do some shoulder rolls, and some neck rolls to help address that portion of it. Also, you could do some like stretching you know, the wall, or you could just walk up the wall. Uh, you take it, you just kind of come up to where you can tolerate it, go straight up to the sides, and that just kind of helps things start to move gently. Could also come from here. You can do it laying down, standing up, sitting. Just bring it out just a little bit, so you feel a little pull, but it's not excessively stretching it. I hope this information has helped. And if you have any questions, concerns, please feel free to call the number listed on the screen.